If you're working on dry media like chalk pastels or charcoal, one major concern is how fragile the drawings will be because even with a charcoal drawing like this, which is so dark, even the slightest swipe of your hand could ruin many, many hours of work that you did in that drawing. One option that you can do is you can use spray fixative. With spray fixative, you spray the entire surface of the drawing and the spray fixative gets the charcoal to adhere more strongly to the surface of the page, so it's a lot less likely to get smudged. Now, it's not perfect though, because even a drawing which has spray fixative on it can still get smudged and ruined, but it is much less likely that that's gonna happen. The most important thing to know about spray fixative is that it's really toxic. Never ever spray it indoors, it's really dangerous. You have to make sure that you're outside spraying it there. That's really the only safe way to do it. Some people like to use aerosol hairspray instead of spray fixative because it's cheaper, it's not toxic, you can use it indoors. But the problem with aerosol hairspray is that it's not an archival material. So you don't know long term what the aerosol hairspray is going to do to your drawing. It could easily degrade over time. For that reason, I would stick with the spray fixative. There are two kinds of spray fixative. There is workable fixative and there is permanent fixative. Workable fixative is really flexible because you can spray a drawing and then even after you've sprayed it, you can continue to work on it. So there is that option with workable fixative. Now with permanent fixative, you don't have that option. Once you've sprayed the permanent fixative on your drawing, you can't work on it anymore. So you really have to be confident that you're totally done working on that drawing. To use the spray fixative, you're gonna take the bottle and you're gonna hold it, I would say about six inches or so away from your drawing. You're gonna go all across like this to make sure that you hit every single corner of the drawing. And you wanna make sure that you're not using too much. Like I pretty much just do one pass over the whole drawing, that's enough. I mean, if you get to the point where your drawing's wet, that's way, way too much. I mean, really a little bit of fixative goes a long way, so you shouldn't feel that you really need to overdo it. 